Hi everybody, welcome to a new series of tutorials on BLAST Groovebox. Um, in this first video, I like, to, as I normally do, to go through the user interface and the navigation on the controls. So this is the first screen, uh, screen you come to when you load the application. You have four tracks. Uh, so one on drum machine, chords, monosynth and monosynth, which of course you can customize. Here you have practically um, your loops, which can be defined uh, based on uh, on uh, the um, instrument that you have selected. So you can have, for example, a loop on drum machine. You can scroll, of course, to have multiple ones. Here you have the tempo, here you have the play button. You can access, uh, for example, here the effects. You have normally a back button and the mixer section. You have a menu here for configuration, which we'll have a look at um, in the next videos. And then you have a load the save menu where you can load, for example, demo. So let's uh, load one and click on load and OK. And here is the, the demo loading. As you can see, you have different loops that have been created for the number of tracks. And to show you a little bit how it works, you click play. <laughs> And of course you can change for example to the next one like that you can also do that when you play okay and um, you can select different loops of course as i just showed you and you can click and hold and go into selection for example the edit of the drum machines where you can see the rhythm that has been created and you have additional controls for looping bars grid the speed if you want to solo it you can go inside the pads for example and decide which tempo you want to use and um, just to show you also what it looks from a synth perspective if we click and hold on that and edit here you have a view of the notes for the particular pattern again you can choose the pads and you can see the keys as well if you prefer to see the keys you can see the scales which has been applied and you can also edit the synth which allows you to go inside the synth itself and you can choose some preset from here which you can load um, and you have always a back button to go back right and when you see a white um, um, box like this it means you can click on it and go to further settings to customize it again and, and as you can see back again and we are inside the edit of the same here. You can access the send effects from here as well, as well LFO, etc., etc. So you have always a back button to go back to the previous screen. Here we are on the main screen. So let's load a couple of other uh, demos uh, so that you get an idea of the capability and the sounds. Let's load uh, Future World and let's click play. Let's load another one again, Giant Sleeping Robot. Let's click load and press OK again. Okay. I'm going to stop here and I'll see you at the next video on the Blessed Groovebox. Thank you. Bye.